Look how beautiful this is. You make gorgeous balloon designs. Have you ever had this conversation? What if this is the one you could have instead? Welcome to the Van Answer Studio. This was a text message exchange I had with a potential client a couple weeks ago. And we sent so many messages back and forth to even get a general idea of what she thought she wanted for her event. But I'm changing all of that with the help of today's sponsor, Fiverr. I'm gonna make a custom balloon menu for my own balloon business and show you what I'm including in that and how you can make a beautiful one for your own business. So first of all, what is a balloon menu? It's a one to two page document that gives potential clients a general idea of the designs you offer, at what price point, and your contact information. These are usually digital, so you can easily send them via messenger or email, or they can live permanently on your website or social media pages. To make this menu, I need to find an artist who can illustrate my designs. Now I have some illustrating experience, but my skills are pretty rudimentary, and it would take me a long time to make a design like this. So instead, I'm gonna hire a professional designer off of Fiverr who can do this way faster than I can. So let's find a couple artists to work with so you can see a few options and how each artist interprets my ideas. Fiverr has all kinds of professionals available to help you out, but today I'm searching for balloon designs. Some really cute balloon stuff here. Balloon fonts. Okay, so this is Val Fetty Creates, and she specifically says, I will design a realistic looking digital balloon price menu for your balloon business. This is exactly what we're hoping for. Look at these adorable menus. So she does all of this. Looks like she also makes mock-ups, which is so cool. And she uses Qualitex color chart. So if you have a specific brand identity and you know what balloons go along with that, you can tell her what they are in Qualitex colors and she can match those. Those are awesome. We also want to look at file type. So if it's a non-editable file, like a PNG, it means that once you set the pricing on this, you can't necessarily edit it on your own. You'd have to have them make another one. So if you want to be able to edit pricing or any kind of information aside from the designs, you want to make sure your deliverable files are in something that you can edit. So an editable PDF, the original Photoshop or Illustrator files, if you have those programs on your computer, um, are all things you want to keep in mind with whoever you book. This gig looks great. I'm thinking I might go with the standard package. Because I'm kind of wanting seven balloon arrangements, I kind of fall into this nine balloon arrangement page. So I'm going to go up here and actually save this to a list that I've called balloon menu. And once I've got a couple artists favorited, then I'll reach out and book them all at once. Okay, let's go back to the original search. Let's try this one, Arts by Darla. So she is a level two seller, which means she has had at least 50 orders with great reviews. And look how whimsical this design is. These look hand illustrated. How beautiful is this? Yeah, look, so we could send her photos of our work and she'll turn it into a design. Love it. So let's contact her and see if she's willing to make a balloon menu. You never know. I mean, it looks like she's got all of the software and the skills. So I'm just gonna send her a quick message. Okay, now while we're waiting for her response, let's see if we can find someone else. Let's try and broaden our search out to menu. You know, there's lots of people who design restaurant menus as well as like salons and things like that. And maybe we can find someone who does custom illustrations to make what we're looking for. Okay, so here is a menu designer. And look how cute this menu is. So she does custom illustrations for this. So all of these cute little food items down here are her own drawings, which is just fantastic. I mean, look how detailed this is. So let's also send her a message and just see if this is something she's willing to do. While I wait for those replies, let's talk about what should be included on a balloon menu. I've compiled this Google Doc with all the details I want included on mine, so I can easily send it to the Fiverr artist, but this was also a great exercise in figuring out what designs I want included and my pricing. At the top of this list, I've got my business branding as well as my contact information. This includes the proper spelling and spacing of my business name, as well as any ways I want to be contacted by potential clients. I've got my logo on here so that they can insert that onto the document and my brand colors. 
Now that first artist had her colors set to Qualtex colors, so I went and figured out exactly what my colors were in Qualtex balloons, and I included that as well so that everyone has the same color reference. With those basic details out of the way, we can finally talk about what designs to actually include on this balloon menu and the strategy involved in picking those designs. Here's a couple things I took into consideration when choosing my designs. First, what did I have in inventory? What do I like making? And what is popular in my market? I also want to include multiple design types. That's garlands, columns, walls, or anything built on frames or stands, and then more package deals. So that's you know the arch with the balloons and the neon sign, or the shimmer wall with balloons on it, so people can see not only individually things I offer, but what they look like in a package. I also need to include designs at different price points so that they can see the range available. I've got my inexpensive pieces as well as my top tier pieces with a few in the middle. When I was initially putting this together, I noticed that I had too many pieces at that $300 range and not enough at a higher price point. Having this diversity of price points allows them to come in and pick whatever works for their budget and see a wide range of things you offer. I'm not going to get into my pricing philosophy in this video, just know that the prices that you see on these designs are what works in my market for my business. You may offer the exact same designs, but they would be at a wildly different price point in your own market. So just take these with a grain of salt and figure out the pricing for your own business. While I was compiling everything in this Google Doc, I got messages back from those two artists and they gave me the green light as well as a custom listing. So let's go ahead and get everybody booked. So let's start with Val. She's the one who has the standard packages and I think standard is the one I'm going to choose, the, the two page menu with nine balloon arrangements. So this is going to be $85 and we should have it in three days. Just simply amazing. So let's hit go. Okay, now that I've got all the payment information in, the next page is requirements. And every artist has their own questionnaire that you fill out, and that gives them the information they need to make your product. So I've gone in and answered all these questions and uploaded my Google Doc to them, and then I'm gonna hit order. And now we just wait until that one comes through. Okay, Arts by Darla is one of the artists that I sent a message to to see if she would do a custom offer for me. And this is the custom offer in the messages that we sent back and forth. So I'm gonna go ahead and click accept offer and get that one going. Okay, the last artist is the one who makes restaurant menus. And with her custom offer, it came in at $120. She's gonna make me seven custom illustrations that will all be on one page. So let's go ahead and accept that offer. And then we'll come back once they arrive. The balloon menus are here. I have not peeked because I've been waiting to do this on camera with you, but I can't send it anymore. So let's open the final designs. Now this is Kanna, and she is the one who makes restaurant menus, but so graciously did a custom listing for us for a balloon menu. Now she sent me a couple files as a JPEG, a PDF, and she sent me the AI files. So I can go in and edit the pricing on these later on. So let's get into this. Oh, look how cool this is. So you would never know that she doesn't do balloon work. Like oh, with all the highlights on the balloons, Oh, she made my designs come to life. Look how good this looks. And I can get in here and edit the text and stuff. And she gave us so many different file types. So we can do all kinds of different things with these designs. I love it. The second artist is Arts by Darla, and she's the balloon logo one that has the hand-drawn style. And she initially sent me a black and white hand drawing of what she created so I could give approval before she added the color in. So I've had a tiny sneak peek at this one in black and white, but here's the color. So she sent me a PNG on a white backdrop, a PNG on a transparent backdrop, a PDF, and she sent me the Photoshop files. So I can go in and edit the text on this one as well. So let's open this. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, the little highlights on the bubbles and her hand-drawn style. This is so whimsical and so beautiful. I mean, look at the colors on these balloons. They're all shaded with these fun little highlights on them. I mean, look at the foil balloons. The highlights that she did on those is just stunning. 
if you wanted a whimsical hand-drawn style, this, this girl's amazing. I am so blown away. I could never draw anything like this. This is so cool. I love this. Okay, let's get into the last design. So here is Val. Now she is the one who had the standard package of nine. And while we were communicating back and forth, I decided to go ahead and put nine designs onto these menus so that we fell into her standard package and you could see what that standard actually looked like. So this one does have a couple extra designs on it compared to the other ones, but oh my goodness, these are, these are so cool. Okay, let's open the final. Oh man, look at the gradients on these balloons. Like, and they're all different sizes with the mini clusters on them. This is such a gorgeous style, but still realistic enough that you can help visualize what it would look like in real life. And these colors on these are just amazing. Like here you've got the shimmer backdrop with my balloon colors on it. Like I love how my branding comes through so strong in all of these designs. This is simply stunning. Oh, my, my clients are going to love this. This is going to give them such a beautiful way to see what I offer and at what price points. This is absolutely amazing. All three of these artists have done such brilliant work. I, I don't know how I'm going to choose which one to use in my business. And if you would like to use any of these artists for your own balloon menu, I'll leave them linked in the description box below so you can easily find them. And if you'd like to save a little money, you can use my coupon code event answer for 10% off your Fiverr purchase. So thank you again to today's sponsor Fiverr. And until the next time, remember, stay creative, everybody.